Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Night Witches. So as you can see up here, we've advanced the timeline a fair bit. Wolverine and Erenia are waiting to come back. Um, but uh, let's have a look at the mech bays real quick. So I did make some adjustments on the mechs. One is I changed the this, the uh, camouflage pattern on some of these. The Griffin is our melee mech. I'm just thinking that this is probably the best <laughs> the best look for the Griffin. I didn't realize this was here, but now I do. So that's that's pretty awesome. So the Bushwhacker we changed slightly. We are keeping this an SRM boat. Um, so I pulled out the Clan SRM, and we've got I, I, I managed to fit a bunch more stuff in here. So we got two SRM sixes on this side, SRM six triple plus, another SRM six triple plus, and an SRM four triple plus. So uh, we got bonus to hit ammo, uh, acid ammo, and dead fire ammo all included in here, so we can swap around them. Um, I think this is probably enough. Got the proto heatsink kit engine in here. Uh, we did put the light engine in. It cost us a fair bit, but um, yeah, so that gave us the weight that we needed to be able to do what we needed here. I uh, left the, the arm out of here because we don't really need anything on this side right now. So yeah, that's kind of how this guy's laid out. And then let's have a look at um, the Shadowhawk. Was it the Shadowhawk? Yes, the flame unit. This was the other one I changed around. Once again, this is it's been a few days since I've played this, so... Um, I'm a little bit, I gotta get back up to speed again. So we've got, we kept the three flamers on each side, put a fluid gun in, uh, and we put a plasma cannon in. This um, was what we were talking about doing before, so we did it, put the plasma cannon in. Um, I believe, yeah, we got the 280 engine, so this thing is pretty darn fast uh, still, and I think we. I can't remember if we took a mask out of this or not, but we're definitely still fast enough. Put some case in here, heats and cooling pods, so we're running pretty darn heat efficient with all of the weapons firing at once. The uh, the fluid gun is going to give us the opportunity to drop uh, Inferno on, their, on the target. It's only got eight shots, but uh, the heat does last for two turns, so it's good. Uh, plasma cannon for hitting overheated mechs for lots of damage. So that's the other thing that's good about this. So yeah, we managed to roll this all up into one mech, which is kind of nice. So we'll run with that. And uh, let's take a few missions. So the first one I've decided to take today um, is, uh, where is it? Eviction. It's against uh, Clan Ghost Bear. It's a destroyed base mission, so it should be pretty good. Hopefully we can pick up some clan parts. There's a few clan mech parts that we do have, so we might get lucky. And then the next mission we'll probably take, we might take fireworks here. Uh, sorry, no, that's a target acquisition. We don't want to do that. No, thank you. Um, we'll have a look afterwards. But this one is a pretty good one. Hide the evidence is another choice. Destroy the base. Uh, I think this is pirates. So we should be more than capable of handling these missions. Um, good salvage, good payout. We still got half a month to go before before we got to uh, make our financial report. So we can always sell a few things. Okay, so let's get the Shadowhawk. Flame unit into Red Comet. Hunchback can be powered by Sunflower, Griffin with Megasaur, and Bushwhacker. All right, let's deploy this and get it done. Oh yeah, too, I didn't actually change the crab at all. It's still sitting the same. We'll figure that out a little later. All right, this looks fun. Okay, so I remember now when I took off the Shadowhawk. Um, I said it was a mask system. It wasn't. We had a pair of uh, SRMs on there with uh, Inferno ammo, which I traded out for the plasma cannon. Uh, I know it seems kind of strange to do that, uh, but the plasma cannon is going to take advantage of uh, um, bigger damage, bigger hits, so that's kind of why I went that route. The SRMs are kind of nice as a flamer unit, uh, the fact that you can shift back and forth between them. But the one thing you got to remember about that, um, the benefit of having flamers is that you don't, if you have an SRM-6 with Inferno ammo, I don't need to, to use um, uh, six shots, right? With the flamer, it'll give 30 heat. I can just use one if I want to, right? To overheat, plus the bonus damage. Um, the other thing too, um, it's easier to split targets with these. Uh, the other thing with flamers is they have bonus to hit. Um, they do have a shorter range, but they're, but the bonus to hit is good. Uh, the SRMs give you the versatility using other ammo, but flamers won't explode on you if they get hit. So, you know, that's the other thing. Um, you do need a lot of energy points to be able to run a proper flame boat like this, whereas if you have, you know, a pair of SRM6s with Inferno ammo, that works great. 
Um, but yeah, it just really, it's to your preference, I still prefer the Flamers right now, simply because of the bonus to hit, right? Flamers give you an accuracy bonus, so, and SRMs can be tricky, depending on how you're using them. Um, but yeah, that's just my two cents, plus the weight too, right? Like if you throw an SRM 6 in to do um, 30 heat damage, um, you have to hit with all six of them. This, I've got three, each of which has a bonus to hit, and that's three tons, plus I don't have to carry a ton of ammo, right? So it's lighter. Um, Heat-wise, it's also it's also um, uses up less, less uh, heat on your mech as well, so that's kind of a benefit. Um, it's just really, once again, it's to your preference, whichever you like to run with. Confirmed. I'm liking the flamers. Okay, let's get up here. Acknowledged. Let's give him a target. I'm not going to move you in very far. Let's just walk into here and brace. You're really the hammer. Um, Understood. Moving fast. Okay, let's see what we got here. Got something. A white. 35 tons. Don't know if they can see us. Oh, maybe they can. Here comes the white. No, nope. Nova. Ooh, nice. Um... Let's just hammer him. What do we got back here? Arctic Wolf. Okay. Um, yeah, we're running super cool. Fire. We got about 10 turns of continuous fire on here with the LK ammo. We also have acid ammo and um, um, dead fire ammo as well. Holding on the holding off on the acid because I gotta decide what mech I want it parts from. I think it's probably gonna be the Nova. It's 50 tons. Arctic Wolf's 40. Um, but we don't have parts for either of these guys. Although I do think we've got oh, it's Vapor Eagle. I do think we've got uh, parts for um, for the white though. Got it. Wow, we still can't get visual on these guys. Uh, let's just shoot. Standing by. Let's see if we can get... Yeah, so we're running incredibly cool off this guy. Uh, let's just fire on him. They sure do. Sorry, buddy, but you're like the only person I can see. What's up, boss? And I can't waste a turn of firing, so I'm going to put myself between y me. Well, between. <laughs> going to put myself between uh, the uh, Flame Hawk and this guy. Here it comes. Of course, knocking off the far side again. It's a tricky thing to do, but we're able to do it. Because we're so awesome. Something wrong with that guy. Guess they got a couple of jams up there. Okay, I gotta decide who I'm gonna kill here. I don't know, maybe... Let's try and keep the Nova. He's running away. Wow. Uh, 
You can't actually go through there, eh? That's so bizarre. Full 12%, wow. 23. Let's switch the SRM4 out to acid ammo. We might get one hit. Well, let's go with SRM6. Maybe we get a hit off that. Yeah, it looks like we got a couple hits. Now we can just start applying a damage to the legs of this guy. Kind of getting the reverse now. It's weird. I was just playing, uh, I played two episodes of, uh, Jade Falcon Freeborn. The mechs that we were fighting against, they really couldn't see us and they weren't shooting back. Now I'm getting the reverse of that, having to fight the clans and then they're just like, you know, all over us here. Uh, let's just sprint down. Sprint down right to here. Um, damage 64 with the plasma, really. Let's turn it off for, for now. Hit this guy with the rest. Waiting for orders. <sighs> it's not going to give us enough evasion, is it? It is not. Roger that. Got to start playing this smarter, going against my my uh, instincts to do bad things. See if we can target the leg on this guy and fire. Okay, that looked, that looked like a hit. Target acquired, nice. It was a hit. Um, Standing by. On it. The bonus is is that we've got the uh, acid on this guy right now. I'm gonna warlord even though I don't need to. But we want to give us a better chance to hit against this leg. So we're going to take the leg, hopefully. There it is. Inflicted some heavy damage. So hopefully we can clean this guy up next turn. Hopefully Babi I can clean up that Arctic Fox. Or Arctic Wolf, whatever he is. Arctic whatever. Wolf. I don't think the Vapor Eagle is going to move in. But it's nice if we can get some eyes on him next turn. So Megasaur can punch the shit out of him. Sorry, punch the crap out of him. Pardon my French. Pardonnez-moi. Okay. So I think the white is the next target for Megasaur. Let's see if we can punch that guy out. Uh, wow. Getting a little payback, are we? I understand you being upset. I really do. I totally understand you being upset. But that was really just uncalled for. Oh, well, we only had 76% chance to hit. Fluid gun hit. I think it did, anyway. It did, yeah. Acid's on him. Uh, we need to move, so let's get ourselves, no, over here, and we're going to target that other leg, and fire, I think that's it, yep, ah, you got the torso as well, oh well, got the legs though, that's the most important thing. How far can we move? Not far enough. This guy really, really, really needs a uh, a mask system, but it's just going to add so much uh, heat. Yeah, that's fire. That's a, kill. That's a meltdown. Uh, 
Uh, I'm going to go LK and oops, acid with the... Whoops, I thought that was the four. It switched positions. There we go. And fire. Okay, we got some acid on him. Nice. It'll change the damage for next turn. See what they're doing here. He's fleeing. He's fleeing. Whenever you ever know the clans to just run away. You can't even call it a tactical retreat either. You're right through the flame. He's just running away. What's up with the white here? Bet you he jumps behind the griffin. That's what I'd do. Well, actually, I'd walk behind the griffin because I don't have jump jets. Oh, okay. Better be an ace pilot. Don't matter where you go, you're going to get punched in the back. Come on. Show me what you're doing. Somehow I don't think there's going to be any uh, reinforcements here. We're around four. They probably would have shown up by now. Oh, maybe they wouldn't have. I don't know. Wow. They've got a lock on me. Uh-huh. Thanks for coming out. Waiting for the right move. Oh, uh, he gets the move first, so let's see what he does. <laughs> and then we'll melt his ass. Oh, he's coming back. Wow, nice shooting. You really don't want to be an overheating target around me, man. You really, really don't. Wow, that's really low chance to hit, though. Let's increase them a little bit. Eh? Eh? Uh, a couple hits. Let's see what he does now. Still gonna fire, huh? I was just about to say, it looks like he shot me in the face. Sure enough. You don't shoot me in the head and think you can just get away, do you? It's not how this game works, buddy. Yeah. Oh, he's got an AMS. Here it comes. Right torso, nice. Tagged him. Alright, let's finish this guy up. Firing. Good night, sweet white. Okay, let's get the acid reapplied to this guy if we can. Uh, yep. I know I got recoil issues with the SRMs, but should be all right. Should be all right. Don't know if we're going before. Yeah, we're all going before this guy. All right, let's shoot for this leg. So, actually, forget it. Let's just target him. Let's just get rid of him. Fire. Fire. Connection on that one. Receiving one. Heading out. Just gonna fire. In all Reporting critical hit. Okay. I'm here. See if we can Let's melt this guy. Let's go. Here it comes. 
Eh, only 58. Still not bad. The fact that the other, the other thing too is the fact that the flamers don't run out of ammo. Compared to the SRM6, unless you carry extra ant rounds, you're gonna run out of flamer ammo. They got a sensor lock on me. Flamers never run out of ammo, so. Rack five, eh? Just a little too far away. Waiting for orders. He's got nothing left. There you go, guys. There's a perfect example of why you don't put all your weapons in your arms. Should turn those off. Oh well. Target eliminated. Okay, let's move in. Uh, we got a nice big fat hill here between us and them. Uh, we don't want to get on these guys just yet. On it. We want to close with them first, I think. Better chances to hit. Uh, let's just move, yeah. Get our stability back. Okay, so the rack must have become unjammed. Commander. How far can we get up here? Let's get eyes on both. This guy, I think, has got the rack, so let's shoot him. Tag an ER pirate firing. Gotcha. Splitting fire into nothing. Ready for orders. Get rid of this rack if we can. Firing. I copy. Not quite enough. Yes, Commander. Okay, let's get around here. Hit them with a the plasma cannon. Yeah, pretty darn good chance to hit. We're gonna fire. All right. Not enough to kill it though. Don't think we can get. Hardened Sniper Turret. So this is the opportunity that we have now. To go this route. One of the reasons why we carry the dead fire. 14 damage per missile. Uh, let's increase that. Because we can. 15 damage per missile. Firing. There it is folks. Bushwhacker can be devastating Ready for orders. as long as you have the ability to get in close and have a good chance to hit. Once you have that, it's... Oh! Grip. 40 tons. Phoenix Hawk. Phoenix, I guess. Let's leave the acid gun off for now. I want these turrets gone. Okay, so let's switch out a dead fire. We don't need much for this one. So let's use two. Turn the rest off. Fire. Okay, plenty. As long as those uh, tur other turrets aren't learning us, then um, I think we're okay. Let's go right here. Um, yeah. Enemy structure is weak. Structure down. It's history. Might as well take that shot. Commander? Flamers. Let's get into, uh, hmm. Order acknowledged. Brace on the ice so that when they shoot me, I slide backwards. Wow, they're not doing anything. They pro I don't know if they can see us. Yeah. 
Watch your position. Keep your stick on the ice. Don't get beat. Should be two guys back here as well, but I want these turrets gone. I don't want to be stabbed in the back by anything. So we're going to once again ensure this turret is liquidated. Hardened sniper turret, and we're going to fire. 275. Firing. So there you go. There's an alpha strike of over 275 damage. Yes, Commander. So enjoyable. Fire on this building. Aye, aye. Waiting for orders. Double time. Let's finish go. the building up. Firing. Okay, if we can kill the stuff that we need to kill here. Um, wow, you can't move very far, can you? Really is kind of sad. Affirmative. Clip the edge of that geothermal, no big deal though. I missed what that was. Looked like it had a double name. Well, maybe not. That was 70 damage. Warning. Armor low. You can see us from way back here. We should probably try and push them. Ambusher Huntsman, that was what it was. So we do have, I think we do have Ambusher and Huntsman parts. That's a lot of damage from long range. Not minimal damage. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Receiving you. <sighs> we know what we need to do. Wow. Yeah, at least we hit him. That's all dead fire ammo. It's going to be really bad chances to hit. So let's not go that route. Let's go like this. Yeah, fire on the turret. All right, not a bad start. I'm receiving you. Could have been a thousand times better, but All right. plasma cannon. Let's hold off. We got five rounds left. On the move. Full speed. Let's close with these guys, and we'll fire on this turret. Light standard turret, large, medium, two machine guns, okay. Huntsman trying to get a flank on us. All right, what are you guys doing? Ambusher pull him back. Okay. So he's leaving the huntsman out to dry here. Oh, he's up on the hill now. Trying to get the height advantage, eh? Yep, don't blame you. We don't have the long range weapons to handle you from up there, so. Uh, Commander. 
Understood. Moving fast. Wow. A little better on this guy. Let's take it. No, that's your target right there. Uh, let's make sure it's gone. Plasma, everything on. Target destroyed. Receiving you. Chase these fuckers down. I'm coming to get you guys. He's backing up. Okay, this guy's got to switch to acid ammo, and we're gonna fire. I think we missed. I think we missed with the acid. How evil am I? Let's see what they do. I was just actually considering coming back here and giving this guy a pasting. Like just, now that they've pulled back, pulled back this way and hammered these guys, but they got a chance for back shots and stuff, so. Don't want to give them that. Let's see how close we can get. Roger. We have eyes on. Um, gonna leave the plasma cannon off and fire the rest. Okay. Wow, only one hit, eh? Gonna wait. Gonna wait. We need Megasaur back in here. Watch the yeah, it's okay. Relax. Just relax. Light damage, Commander. We'll kill this guy this turn. Unless the Huntsman decides to show himself like a fool. What's up, buddy? Minimal damage on that hit. Order. First order of business. Let's give this guy the what for. <laughs> Like we got the acid on him. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Uh, okay. Give us the best chance to hit. How much dead fire we got left? 44. Dead fire and acid? Thinking? Let's do it. Somebody's not having a good day. Huh. 
Okay, I'm glad I, I'm glad we pushed these guys now. Acknowledged. Goodbye. Okay, problem one solved. Um, what do you say we give you some payback? Copy that. And fire. Ah, uh, not much payback. Okay, what do we got next here? Phoenix Hawk? No, the grip. You need to come to grip with your life because I'm coming around behind you for some shenanigans. Down. Next destroyed. Machine guns are empty. That's all right. That's all right. Let's get into here. Shoot this guy. Do the fluid gun off for now. We don't need it. That's a miss. It is, but this sure as hell won't be. We got 20 rounds of dead fire left, so let's shoot 18 of them. Switch this guy to LK ammo. Dead fire? Shoot 20 of them? Sure, why not? Wow, you took that, eh? Well, it is 40 tons. It is a 40 ton mech. Uh, yeah. Not gonna take it for more than one turn, though. Or two turns, that is. What's up, boss? Uh, let's reserve. Let's just see if he gets into range here. See what he does. Come on, buddy. Bring it in. Group hug. He's contemplating his life. Do I leave and live my life in disgrace or do I die and be honored as another fallen mech warrior? It's going to go for the fallen mech warrior. Yes, Commander. Uh, I'm going to reserve her. Let's get Comet in. It's right here. Here's your opening right there. Get the plasma cannon off. Gonna fire. Wow, only two. Okay, 24 is not bad. Waiting for orders. Yeah, let's attack. Move order received. Oop, should have turned the acid on. Oh well, my fault. 167 damage, not bad. Alright, shoot up his side. Or not? Really? Alright, see what he does. Might be able to kill him and the rest of the buildings this turn, but we'll see how it goes. That torso is badly damaged. Fire fist? Really? It's gonna melee. No! You better miss. Oh, okay. Looked like an arm hit. That shot went internal. Okay, Contact pulse crit. Me. 
ready for orders. Let's show them how we do. Got it. Should turn the acid on. Oh. I'm receiving you. This guy's got to go down, man. Uh, we need to hit him from the front too. Twenty-two percent. That's it. Everything on fire. Okay, we got the torso. Reporting critical hit. Well, this is scary. Twenty-three and thirty-two, eh? Right? Firing. Um, yeah, fire everything into a side. Not quite enough, eh? <sighs> Shoot him again. Fire everything. Fire everything! Let's just turn this to acid just in case. We have to shoot again. We do. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Make sure my back's against the wall. Yes, Commander. Okay, girl, you should be able to take this out. Roger. Engaging. Yeah. Oh, that was just a leg? I can't tell because it's not showing me. Oh, that's it. My machine guns are empty. Well, that's alright. I'm here. Nicely done. Moving out. Engaging target. Incinerate everything. Target destroyed. Standing by. It doesn't really matter what you shoot. Finish this up and go home. There it is, folks. No, you can meet us right here. We're tired. Alright, so contract and pay payment increased by 45%, which we do need because uh, we're going to take some sea bills damage here. Yeah, Hunchback took a lot of damage, but couldn't avoid it. We took uh, medium pulse crit so we can figure to get that fixed up, but everything else is pretty much fine. Let's see what else we got here. All right, so salvage. Nova parts are possibilities. Uh, but it's only a 50 ton mech though. Vapor Eagles are what, 55? Uh, what else do we have clan wise that we can snag here? Laser AMS clan. We've already got one, so we don't need that. LB-10X clan. Possibility. Hmm. Just general clan armor. Huh. Ooh, DDI cockpit. Plus three initiative with this guy. Clan Endo Steel. Um, fire control system improved. There's our C bills for the month. Machine gun. IFF jammer. Clan heatsink kits. If we just need C bills, those are a good choice. A lot of patchwork materials, prototype heatsink. There's no prototype double heatsink kits though. We got three of these right now. Sensor flight, really. Death from above damage. 
Recon sensors. Those are kind of good. Talents. Yes, please. Um, upper ballistic. I don't know, man. 15% called shot. Yeah. If you want to start taking legs off uh, heavy mechs, thinking the called shot bonus is going to be uh, really needed. Recon sensors are nice. Uh, Bloodhound probe, that's kind of nice too. Well, let's go with this. We can't finish any mechs, so there's no point in taking mech parts. This is confirm. So, Huntsman part, Nova part, two Vapor Eagle parts, okay. LB10X, Clan Tag, Endo Steel, which we can use. Hand, which are always welcome. Uh, Hyper Goss ammo. Alright, well, could have been a lot better. Okay, let's have a look here. 115,000. 111,000. Yeah, expected that much. Took a lot of damage. The Huntsman and the um, Ambusher were nightmares for us. Let's have a look here. Uh, Hunchback up. Uh, Bushwhacker up. Griffin and the Flamehawk. You know what? We can leave the Hunchback down for now. Because we have... Um, actually, bring the Wolverine up too. We've got uh, the Crab we can take with us for the next mission. So let's get the first guys back here. We'll take another mission before we end up. Uh, you want to borrow Satori, eh? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, we don't need her right now. Uh, we want to get the Wolverine back, so four days. Uh, set up a targeting range, why not? Gains 100 experience. What the hell? We can shoot shit up inside the ship. Why not? There we go. Um, so let's have a look at the bays real quick. Wolverine we got back. So the Wolverine. Large medium pulses. Right. LRM5 with narc ammo. So that's going to help out a little bit. Um, pretty heat neutral overall, overall. So let's go and take another mission here really quick. Okay, so we've got a good lance to run here. Mm, gonna leave the crab out again for now. Still not happy with this loadout. It's kind of mediocre. It's a good second lance mech, but not for what we need it for right now. So let's have a look at the command center contracts. What do we got going on? Um, should be at least two and a half and above another destroy base mission against pirates um, hungry wolves defend base mm. thinking this is probably going to be the best mission to take for salvage we've got enough for our financial report we should be fine don't want to do target acquisition mission take the bait uh, maybe that's both of these are better when we have the uh, hunchback back. Um, yeah, so let's go and take, hide the evidence, destroy base. We should be able to pull this one off relatively quickly. Full salvage. It is only pirates after all. I mean, come on, what, what's the worst that could happen? Okay, this one. Warning, you are entering a black site. Let's do this. You're pirates, we don't care. Your piratey ways. Full speed. Standing by. We don't care about you and your piratey ways. We're here to take your shit. Full throttle. 
Yeah, before we forget, let's just outfit this with the acid ammo. Yes, Commander. I. Yeah, this thing needs something in it to make it faster. I have to figure out what we're going to do with that. Ah, uh, it's reserve. We got company. Wasp is not company. A wasp is a pest. Hunter, eh? Sure. Gun carrier. Enemy sensor lock detected. Okay. Damage minimal. What's up, boss? Well, you're squashable, so let's take that. Got it. Here it comes. Nice. Insult to injury. Gotta add that a little bit. One for the scrappy. Sure as hell is. Alright, let's get on this guy. Copy that. Yeah, we got plenty of narc ammo, so we'll just fire it. Got it. Goodbye. Target eliminated. I'm receiving you. Raptor 2, huh? This was the wrong mech to bring. Alright. Damage minimal. Ah! Lots of lerm turrets. get close enough, eh? Alright, just fire on this guy. Tagged. Or narc, that is. Waiting for orders. Should be hitting with the plasma here. 64, not bad. Target orders. I think we're just going to ignore those guys down below. We'll let them come to us. Uh, I'll see the fluid gun off firing. Roger. Wonder if they're gonna have reinforcements. What's up, you two? I don't know what's on this gun carrier, but uh, yeah, let's get rid of them. Enemy unit destroyed. Six damage. Do they have dead fire ammo? Possibility. So the back turret's a lerm turret too. They've all got missiles. That's crazy. Oh, he's bringing it in for a hug. I got your hug for you, buddy. Don't worry. We got a hug for you. Do the plasma off for this turn. Ah, I should have left it on. Receiving you. We punch this turret? No. <laughs> totally would have been worthwhile. Oh, yeah. It's 
Still not enough. Come on. Guys, this is not difficult. Sure. Wow, really? Okay, that makes up for it. Why not? And it's fire right in this guy's face. Ready for orders. Moving to position. Yeah, let's get some acid on it. That'll definitely help everybody out. There we go. Just inside flamer range. See if you can kill it. That's a lot of big numbers. One less turret. Nicely done. Ah, Raptor wants to duke it out with me. That's okay, we'll duke it out. We shall duke it out. I think we already hit him with uh, the acid. Looks like. Alright, dump everything into this guy. Okay, some solid damage there. They must have dead fire ammo in there. That makes sense. Firing. Is that enough? No, nope. really? Do you want to play the back game? Guy? Really? Do you want to play that game? We can certainly play that game. Got a feeling there's no reinforcements or we would have heard about them for now. Or by now. Taser beam. Taser. Who's this? Oh, target. The wrong, we got the wrong person here. Let's get down to see both these turrets because we're going to split fire. Put a couple of. I should put one medium pulse in there for now. Fire the rest of the other one. Okay, it's narked. There we go. Yeah, the acid damage makes a huge deal in the long run. Like, it's really a huge deal. It's the difference between hitting 15 and 19. It's like a lot. Fire everything. Well, I don't want to wreck this guy completely because we do have um, raptor parts. Let's just fire. Might be able to pick up a raptor. Sure, why not? Ready for orders. 
I copy. Yeah, this one firing. Got it. Enemy structure eliminated. Stand in by. Yeah, fire everything. More than enough. Down. Was that me or did I just hear screaming? It sounded like I heard screaming coming from the building. <laughs> I feel guilty now. No, I don't. We're getting paid. I do, but I don't. It's a game. Okay, nicely done second mission. 20% increase in payment, which is excellent. Very little damage, if any. Raptor parts. Uh, I know if I take raptor parts, we will get a full raptor. Uh, we already have... Wow, it's got a lot of hard points. We already have a bunch of raptor parts. I just want to double check down here what else we have. Medium laser pirates. It's the ERs that give us the extra damage. Medium VSPL. Mm, it's four tons. That's the tricky thing, right? Taser. It's a taser. Um, don't need endo steel or anything like that. Fuel cell. We could sell that. That's a really good chunk to sell. Fire control system improved. We have the clan version. Double heat sink kit. We've got two still. Patchwork materials are good. Powered sensors. Mm, another void system. We've got one. I know we want to run a lot more, but we'll find more. That's the thing, right? A lot of heavy am heavy rifle ammo and stuff. So let's go back up here. Let's take... I know we have enough. I'm going to take four Raptor parts. we got more than enough, but I'll take four of these to make sure we get the mech and the fuel cell for sea bills. All right, one, two, three, four, five Raptor parts, which means we do get this Raptor version. Wasp, Flamer, Pirate. Uh... Yeah, actually, you know, for what was there, we didn't make out too badly at all. So that's actually pretty good. Okay. There it is. Uh, voice signature system. Let's see what we get off this guy. 28000 for repairs, which is really nothing compared to what we made. I'll take us into the next month anyway. Uh, let's have a look. We got stuff we can sell, so I'm not worried about the financial report. So the Raptor, we have enough for our second Lance now, so we definitely need to find another pilot. Doesn't look like much left in here, though. Not a whole lot left, eh? Wow. Not a whole lot left at all. It is an Omnimech, though, so... In a way, that's kind of a bonus. Got about eight tons left after we do that. Which means we don't have to put an engine core or anything. It's already built in. We can put uh, armor on it and stuff. So this is actually a pretty good find. Look at all the hard points. This is going to be a nice, nice mech to load out. So let's confirm this. Let's get that fixed and up and running. So now we got to de decide who our, our second last going to be. Let's have a look in the, the uh, hiring hall to see if there's anybody in here. Don't think there is. I think I checked before, but high roller, 19, petty criminal, eh. Commander? No. Um, yes, Commander. Sheet metal, entry level corporate merchant. That's a possibility. I like the, <laughs> I like the name sheet metal. Right here. Pelican. Okay, listed Navy recruit. We're gonna hire her right away. Um, Simply because you get a minor bonus in starting XP. It's like 2,000, I think. And she's got fours across the board already at 16,000. So that's actually, she's actually a really good find. So we're going to hire her. Plus she has a Russian accent, which is, I do terrible Russian accent, sorry. I think we'll hire Sheet Metal as well. Uh, not the best cost, but the um, merchant shop discount can help out, I think, and maybe in the long run. But let's just get this so that we have enough people for a second Lance. So now that's our team. Uh, let's look at the barracks really quickly. Alright, so we got Chupacabra. Um, let's give her some more gunnery. We'll be running these guys very shortly. 
sheet metal sound. Um, I should call her speed of sound Sonic. If you've ever watched One Punch Man. <laughs> anyway, speed of sound Sonic is hilarious. Um, so Satori will be leading the second lance. Um, yeah, that's great. Um, I think that's really good. So once we get that Raptor up and running, I think we have the right mechs here. If we look in the mech bay real quick. So we'll run the Bushwhacker, um, the Griffin, the Shadowhawk, and what the Wolverine. Yeah, we'll run the Wolverine in the, in the mainland. So we'll be all 55s. Hunchback Crab, um, the Irinia, and the Raptor in the second lance. Crab is really, I think, the weakest mech of the bunch, but we can work on that. That's no problem. Raptor still needs to be outfitted. So does the uh, Irinia. Once these guys get back, we'll have to outfit them. Um, but yeah, I think that's actually a fairly solid second lance. It's at least a two skull, maybe two and a half skull lance once they're loaded up. Uh, because the Raptor and the, the Arrhenia can use pretty much anything anywhere, which is a huge bonus. The Crab is limited by its hard points, unfortunately, and the Hunchback um, kind of limited it a little bit as well. So, I mean, we've only got uh, five laser, one ballistic points on the Hunchback, whereas both the uh, Arrhenia, which has I got, like, you know, uh, 11 ballistic, 15 laser, and 11 missile, and the Raptor was almost the same. We'll be able to drop anything on these guys anywhere. Um, so that should be a bonus. All right, so we're going to leave the episode there. Uh, I will get everything back, repaired, fixed, and updated for the next episode. So we're ready to go. I'll manage the tasks a little bit better. And we do have a bunch of stuff to sell, so I'm not worried about this month's or the next month's um, financial report. Not worried at all. We've got lots of stuff we can sell. So I'll do that in between episodes. And when we come back the next time, we will be up and running and ready to go. All right. So we'll leave it there. If you like the episode, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you later.